Welcome to the report from Tiger Mountain, ladies and gentlemen. We're going to talk about voter fraud in the 2020 US election. Stick around and listen. The report from Tiger Mountain. All right, ladies and gentlemen, voter fraud is becoming a huge issue. We all knew this was coming. Um, you know, Donald Trump and Rudy Giuliani uh, and Newt Gingrich, um, who Donald Trump mentioned in his speech, he said, Newt, you knew this was coming. He said um, they had long suspected that the Democrats uh, were going to actually attempt literal voter fraud and they were going to do it with mail-in voting, which is why all the controversy pre-election about mail-in voting. Um, you know, and we see this appearing the way, the, you know, I mean, the way that voting was put on hold when Trump was winning in three uh, strong uh, red states, um, you know, up around the Great Lakes and below it. And, uh, you know, he was winning. And, you know, he would have taken the election at night and he should have been having a party that night. But no, 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 this is where the fix is in. The fix is in, ladies and gentlemen, you know, um, and the Democrats are trying to literally steal the election. They are not happy with, um, you know, all the bullshit they did during term one, which was like, uh, you know, impeachment, Mueller probe, Russia, 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 uh, the Ukraine scandal, all that nonsense, Schiff and all that nonsense they threw at him. Even this year with COVID-19, Black Lives Matter, Antifa, they threw all that at him and yet still, you know, Donald Trump has a tremendous amount of support in America and won this election. Um, but no, they are now literally trying to steal it from him. And I think Trump is going to fight them. He came out and gave a very strong speech. Now, there's a great rumor going about that, that the actual ballots that were used this year, the paper ballots, uh, have a watermark on them. And that he can now determine which were the authentic ballots and which ones are frauds. And that he can also bring in his own people to count them and they can do a recount and this kind of stuff. So I think that's what we're going to see. I think this could play out um, very similar to the um, you know, 2000 election that went on till December, mid-December, uh, when Al Gore was uh, contending it was uh, George W. Bush. George W. Bush, the Republican, came out, came out winner. And obviously we had eight, eight years of Bush. I do believe uh, it will go to the Supreme Court. And obviously um, recently um, Trump... Uh, uh, installed uh, Amy Comey Barrett, who I, I believe will support the president, will support democracy and uh, and the truth, and uh, and will try and stop voter fraud. So I think we're still in a reasonable position here. But I'm not going to say it's not scary times, ladies and gentlemen. They've pulled out all stops. Obviously, the Democrats have poured every, you know, a huge amount of money. Big tech was behind them. Big media was behind them, and it's all a bunch of bullshit, ladies and gentlemen. And you know, now they are trying literal voter fraud, which makes America look like a. a, a a kind of banana republic and it's a very very scary thing so um you know we'll stay around we're going to give you reports here on the report for tiger mountain and um let's just see how we go and uh you know pray for president trump and uh pray that this um electoral fraud is stopped because you know, america is the um you know is the flagship of western civilization at the moment and if it were to fall to a, a traitor in league with china um, like Joe Biden, it would be a terrible result for not only America, but for the whole world. That's why we must pray and um, you know, help Donald Trump any way we can to fight this uh, evil electoral fraud that's being um, you know, put about in 2020. The report from Tiger Mountain brings you the truth. And uh, stick around here for further reports. Cheers.